I'd like to go on to speak about something called decorum and respectability and decency. Some of these words might be foreign, but as school board members and alleged pillars of the community, I have a problem with the words and actions of your school board member to the point I believe he should be censured in some manner. I am a female, I am a mother, I'm a I have a daughter and a granddaughter, and I find it absolutely appalling that a school board member would refer to another school board member in a demeaning way about her comments or her comments about her looks. But I also find it disgusting that she was called a whore. Mr. Susan, no matter what side of politics you are on, you represent the school board, the entity that educates our children. You publicly owe an apology to Jennifer Jenkins. You made these comments. It's well known also that a state representative not only called her that word, but the C word. Maybe that's the type of man you emulate. Maybe that's the type of man you want to be but we're not going to accept it. The gentlemanly thing to do, the decent and moral thing to do, is to publicly apologize to Jennifer Jenkins. You owe her that. You owe the women that work for you that apology. You owe every mother, every daughter, and every female the apology to Jennifer Jenkins.